addressing forces in a general parade at the Tiger Division headquarters in Juba. The chief of the Defense Forces, General Santino Dengwong, said the visit of the Pope is a blessing to the country. He directed the security apparatus to cooperate among themselves and with the civil population. The army chief said the security personnel will be deployed all over the capital city. <laughs> The Inspector General of Police, General Majek Akech Malok, directed the forces to discharge their duties diligently to guarantee public safety during the peace pilgrimage and beyond. He ordered the forces to <coughs> perform better than they had done in previous occasions. The Assistant Chief of the Defense Forces for Operations, Lieutenant General Toi Chan, underscores the importance of cooperation between the security personnel and the civilians. He described the visit of the Pope and his delegation not only as a milestone but also a source of abundant blessings upon South Sudan and its people. <laughs> The Acting Assistant Inspector General for Operations, Lieutenant General James Gadel, directed the forces to respect their senior officers. <laughs> The Taiga Acting Commander Major General Majok Jokur and Major General Martin Deng of the General Intelligence Bureau also spoke during the parade. It is true most South Sudanese are optimistic <coughs> about the Pope's visit to South Sudan. There are also prominent personalities who question South Sudanese against expecting peace on a silver plate from the Holy Father. Real peace will prevail in the country only when South Sudanese accept, forgive, and love each other, reconcile, heal the wounds of hatred, and work together.